Borderless Higher Education for Refugees, or BHER, is an international consortium of universities and non-governmental organizations who are working together to provide post-secondary opportunities to people living in protracted refugee situations. We do this by offering university credit courses on-site and online and through other technologically enhanced distance learning formats that enable students to earn certificates, diplomas, and degrees in a variety of fields, including health, education, business, science, public administration, and community development. These courses meet international standards and are offered through the joint efforts of partner organizations, including the Faculty of Education at York. All offerings are stackable, allowing students to earn certificates or diplomas at each level of study, incrementally building towards earning degrees. There are currently more than 15 million people caught in refugee situations, often for 10 years or more, as an outcome of war, human rights violations, and or persecution in their home countries. For people in refugee camps, accessing primary basic education is a major challenge. Participation rates in secondary education are very low, especially for women, and post-secondary opportunities are virtually non-existent. Refugees who have completed secondary school almost universally voice the desire to attend university. International scholarships to schools in the global north remain the only opportunity to pursue higher education. Yet these scholarships are few and benefit only about 1% of those who would qualify to attend college or university. In the Dadaab region of Kenya, for example, one of the BHER project sites, there are over 500,000 people living in six camps. Many of them have been there for 20 years or more. Most are under the age of 25. Education within the camps is limited to primary, basic, and sometimes secondary school. Class sizes are immense and learning materials are scarce. Most teachers are recent secondary school graduates themselves with no particular preparation to teach. To redress the situation in Dadaab, the BHER partnership is setting up a project that aims to improve the gender equitable delivery of quality education in refugee camps and adjacent local communities through university teacher education opportunities which will prepare a new generation of teachers. Create continuing opportunities for young men and women in university programs that will enhance their employability both locally and internationally through portable certificates, diplomas, and degrees. And support Kenyan academic institutions that are already offering on-site, online university degree programs to vulnerable and marginalized groups. Overall, then, the BHER program will improve the quality of education in the Dadaab region, increase opportunities for employment in the camps, and contribute to the creation of a new generation of Somalis ready to rebuild the nation upon return to their homeland. In an interview we conducted in the Dadaab camp, a young woman indicated that she wanted to go to school to become a politician. The interviewer seemed surprised at this and can be heard asking, a politician? She responds, yes, a politician, because Somalia needs new leaders. BHER is in Dadaab to support her and her sisters and brothers in their efforts to bring peace to Somalia and to the world.